I've been asked this on several occasions, exit strategy. It's time for us to start thinking about thinking about ending this bull cycle. For some people, the suggestion is that the end of the cycle is very soon. For some people, they think it even already topped out when we hit uh, 68, 69,000 and the rest of the altcoin market then boomed the following week, right? My exit strategy, this is completely me. Um, hopefully my airing these thoughts might help you. I still think that the bull cycle is here. I still think that we're likely to have one last run up to 60, 70, 80, maybe a hundred thousand dollars for Bitcoin and then the altcoin market will splurge after that. So what I'm going to do is I'm keeping an eye on it going back up once again, my theory, my feelings, and then about 80,000, 85, 90,000, I'm going to start selling out of my positions. Why? Yes, you can't ever time the top properly. But if I can time even 20%, 25% from the top, yes, I might not make as much, but I'm then not guessing on the other side, have I lost as much? And then I can buy back in at the bottom. Now, on average, Bitcoin corrects at around about 80%. Once again, loose figures. If anyone's gonna do the maths in the comments, brilliant, right? But at 100,000, that means that we could see a $20,000 Bitcoin at the bottom of the bull market cycle. So in theory, if I sell one Bitcoin at 100,000, I could buy five back in at the bottom. Now, I don't have a Bitcoin, um, but I do have a little bit of holdings. So what I'm going to be doing is selling my Bitcoin at around about 80, 85, 90. Yes, once again, I might miss the top, but at least I haven't lost it and held onto the bottom thinking, oh, is this it? Is this it? Is this the bottom? Is this the bottom? Is this the top, right? Um, when it comes to Ethereum, I'm going to aim for the price target of around about 8,000 dollars once again anywhere between eight and ten thousand dollars is the prediction for the market so i'm going for eight eight and a half nine thousand and shell those out and then with the altcoins as well i'm just going to see how they feel and then i'm going to try and buy back in at the bottom at the bottom of the the the, the 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 big ass correction right that's my theory that's my personal goal i i, I may be wrong <laughs> right but that's how I feel I'm going to do it. I know that I'm never going to be able to time the tippy tippy top and the, the definite body body bottom, right? But I think if I get anywhere near 20% of the top and anywhere near 20% of the bottom, I'm able to maximize how many I have rather than just holding it and seeing it go down to the bottom and go all the way back up to the top. Imagine the stress and the anxiety and the depression. So we'll see. Let me know how you feel about this. Have you got an exit strategy? Let me know in the comment section down below. And I'll talk about how I'm selling my ADA in a video here. Hit subscribe. I'll see you soon. Hope you can hear me over the traffic. Bye-bye.